Joining us everyone with businesses shut down and the stay at home order in place, the price of oil plunged to an historic low today. Industry experts say a lot of tough decisions will have to be made to get through this crisis. Three's on the street tonight. Chris Welty joins us live in Lafayette. And Chris, any reports of layoffs so far? Jim Marcel, no immediate reports of layoffs with this news, but the president of the Louisiana Oil and Gas Association says layoffs are likely for companies to stay afloat. Ten years after the Deepwater Horizon, Louisiana's oil and gas industry is now taking another hit. Oil prices are lower than they've ever been, dropping below zero Monday. If we've seen global demand for oil just be decimated to the tune of 30 million barrels per day uh, as the economy of the world is just shut down and these are just unprecedented times. Logo President Gifford Briggs is hopeful the industry will see some immediate relief and the economy will get moving. Briggs said there are very few industries that can withstand a drastic decrease in their product over a few months. Hopefully the PPP program can provide uh, a lifeline to some companies to be able to withstand uh, the challenges that we're facing. Um, but for many companies, it won't be enough. And for many people, it won't be enough. And ultimately, we're going to have to, you know, companies are going to have to make tough decisions in order to weather the storm. Greg Gotro, president and CEO of Lita, says this hit to the oil industry will have major impacts on Acadiana. Though our economy has diversified from 70% oil and gas in the 80s to 30% today, energy will always play a big role. We have a great base with energy, technology, medical and entertainment. Obviously, all of those are being slammed in one way or another. These are tough times for industry. We're resilient, we're strong, we wanna be a part of the recovery. And if we can get the life support we need now, we'll be ready on the other side to help Louisiana out of these very tough times. This afternoon, Lita stressing that the oil and gas industry needs to rebound, but the economy here in Lafayette Parish needs to continue to diversify. Lita saying that the parish is courting several manufacturing companies, but they would not get into the specifics of which companies they're courting or how many jobs could be coming to Acadiana. Threes on the Street Live in Lafayette, Chris Welty, KTC TV3. Right now, the May contract price for West Texas Intermediate is on the rebound. As of news time, the price of a barrel of WTI crude is above zero at $155. That's a $39 increase during the International Trading Day. The June contract is up a dollar to $21.50. Well, President Trump now suggesting the U.S. could buy roughly 75 million barrels of oil to add to the Strategic Petroleum Reserve. During his coronavirus news briefing today, the president said it's a great time to buy oil and blamed today's price plunge on short sellers. If you look a month into the future, I think it's at 25 or $28 a barrel. So uh, a lot of people got caught. They got caught, and uh, there are a lot of people that are not too happy because they got caught. So if you take a look at it, you'll see it's more of a financial thing than an oil situation. Here's Rob's 24-hour forecast.